Hey, I'm Nathan Clark with your home sold guaranteed realty. Today I got December's market update here in Rhode Island and we're seeing some glimmers of hope out there. We're seeing that there's actually more multifamily listings this month in this time of year than there were last year. We're up 22.3% year over year for multifamilies coming on the market, which is great because we've been dealing with this all year, not enough multifamilies in the market. But we're seeing the same news with the new listings coming on for single family properties. New listings for single families are down 16.6% year over year and down 30% from last month. So quite a decline in single families, but I'd attribute a lot of that to the time of year. Listen, after Thanksgiving till Christmas, a lot of sellers don't want to put their house in the market because they want to still have dinner and Christmas parties and stuff like that. So that's pretty much standard right there. Total number of sales has also declined. We had 804 sales in November of 2023 compared to 965 sales in 2022. So it's a 16.7% decrease year over year for number of sales out there. New listings, a total of down 8%. Still seeing a two month supply of inventory. We were seeing about a one and a half month, one month supply last year. We're seeing about two month supply and days on markets, 35 days. So the days on markets on the tick up a little bit. The national average for interest rate right now is running around 7%, a low sevens, high sixes. That's good news. You'll probably see a little bump of buyers come in the market. Unfortunately, I don't think it's the best time of year for this downplay in interest rates because unfortunately most buyers are sitting on the fence also because of holidays. So that's a tough time. We saw a lot of numbers drop last month to this month, we're seeing prices pretty much hold steady where you're not seeing an increase and we're definitely seeing some flexibility on sellers out there with price. With all this put in mind, it's definitely gonna be a lot of attention on the 2024 market. What happens? Where's everything gonna go? Inventory still tight. Buyer demand has dropped in the last three or four months. So we'll see what happens if inventory continues to rise in the next couple months. My name is Nathan Clark. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to find out what your home is worth, go to NathanClarkTeam.com and you can click right on the report, find out what your home is worth today. Thanks for watching.